There comes a time pretty productive welcome or welcome back to my channel um, before I get started on my plan with me for the week I just want to take a moment and thank you all so much for all the kind words and prayers that you sent me on social media um, on the passing of my dad I just want to let you know that I thank you so much for your support and your kind words and um, just really kind of being that community that I love so much so today what I'm going to be doing is a plan with me from March 14th through the 20th. I of course did not do anything last week. Um, I literally was a post-it note to-do list kind of person <laughs> for the week. Um, you know, sometimes in your life you just have to grab whatever is handy and whatever works for you and that was my go-to. Um, so the highlighters or the tombos I'm going to be using today is 291 which I used in my last one I'm really liking that color right now 195 just for St. Patrick's Day which is the 17th and also 850 which has kind of been my go-to um, I'm going to have all my supplies this is a pencil case I got from Jet Pens what I like about it is that it opens up and is flat so you can kind of just grab things and these are my most used supplies like my slice tool um white outs for tom for this paper which is a little bit creamier tweezers all that kind of fun stuff so i'm just going to put this to the side and then i took a little bit of time um, this was getting super fat and everything was getting bent in here so i went through and i kind of cleaned this out so in here are usually the things that I use every single week or things from my shop. Um, my shop pages are four by six. Um, so they don't fit into the sticker binders, you know, those slide in sheets as easily. So um, I've kind of got those in here and then just a collection of things that I like to use um, weekly. And then in my Replacing the accordion file that you've seen is this. This is from um, Poi and Han. This is their sticker cover. Um, there are also tab dividers in here that are from Poi and Han. Then the inserts are a combination of Poi and Han and um, Amazon. So this one that's divided fits the three and a half by five pages that are pretty standard for emojis, things like that. Um, these you can still get on Amazon or Point Hunt. The bigger sheets that fit the ones that are bigger are a 5x7, which fits a standard kit size. This one has been out of stock on Amazon. I think I still saw them, though, on the Point Hunt site. These bigger rings I got from at Joann's. They are the... Oh, what's the brand? Day? No, not Day. Park Lane. So that's a brand that only Joanne carries. This is, I think, the one and a half ring um, because the smaller rings just, I outgrew them too fast. So, and this binder will be the things that um, I always want to use in my plans, but um, they've never been all in one place. So I couldn't fit any more in this blue container. So I went ahead and put them here. So I've got some things that are no longer available, like these from GP Studios, which I loved. Um, White Deer Stationery. These are from the Giving Girl, and they're translucent, transparent. Um, and then I have the ones from the Planner Spot that came in my subscription box. These are from Cloth and Paper. Um, these are from Panda Bird Designs. I did have to cut them because they came in one long sheet. These dots are the Midori dots, and I got them from Jet Pen. So there's two sizes um, that are available, and they come in kind of three sheets on this um, translucent paper. But the dots themselves aren't as transparent as I normally like. Um, and then I got some bigger ones also from Jet Pens. Peach Palm. Some of these are very old. <laughs> um, these were in a cloth and paper sticker book that is hole punch at the top so I just took them out of there and put them in here 
again, just trying to keep everything together, cloth and paper. Um, and then as I get back here, um, this is a kit from Two Little Bees that I ordered some extra pieces for because I like the deco. So I put those in here, the holidays under this tab, and then the calendars from the planner spot. These actually are what I use in my memory keeping because there isn't a sidebar calendar in there any longer because I'm using the Sadie stickers inserts. And then it goes into my planning, the planner spot, my monthly kit. So um, I just want to pull out March. Let's see where's March. This is February again. And March. So I actually have two different kits for the month of March. One is the kit from last year that I bought on Black Friday. And the other kit is the one from this year. So I'm kind of going to use them interchangeably. So I like to start kind of at the top with my um, washi. Let's see here, what washi do I want to use? That's just plain. I guess I use the honeycomb. I use this one. Okay. So how are you guys doing? Um, I like to say that I am just putting one foot in front of the other right now because um, I think that pretty much describes um, my life. Um, it has been a super busy week as you can well imagine when something like that happens where somebody passes away um, and as much as I felt like we were prepared as far as you know paperwork and things like that um, I am realizing that there were still some things that we should have done while my dad was still feeling okay but you know I can't go back and do it now so um, and I always get questions on the slice tool um, I got mine at either Michael's or Joann's I've seen them online but they're different colors they're orange now and this one is, I don't, I don't even know what to tell you guys, but it's a great tool. It works really well. It doesn't cut through all the way through the paper like some X-Acto knives will. So. And I'm sorry if you can hear my husband and my brother-in-law. They are right outside my window. Um, talking and they talk loud so hopefully it won't come through on the camera okay and then I have a bad habit of putting these on my table so I'm going to just put these back on here I should take a picture once of what happens what my table looks like as soon as I get done doing a plan with me I'm going to highlight the week that we're in so that pops and I am going to highlight the date just to make that easier for me to read. I use these dots. I think last time I used the pink so I use those. So I live in Phoenix, Arizona, if you don't know that. The weather here has just been perfect. Um, this is normally our super busy time in Phoenix. It's spring training. We just got done with the TPC in February, you know, so it's just been just a perfect time of year to be here. I, I always feel sorry when people see it this time of year and then they come back during the summer and it's just a rude awakening to what our summers are like but you know you got to really enjoy the great weather when you have it so that it offsets the time of year that it's not so great okay those are highlighted okay so let's go ahead and get started i'm going to start with my sidebar this time um I'm going to use this one just because it makes me happy. Um, I'm really not a flower person, but um, it's got that green in it for St. Patrick's Day. And then I'm going to start with, let's see here, let's go this one down. So 
And then do I have a, um, let's do, let's do this one over here. Does that match? It matches. It's gonna match. I'm gonna use that one down here. Um, I do desperately need to go to the grocery store today and meal prep for the week. Um, my husband was out of town last week, so I did not <laughs> um, cook one meal, of course. Um, I do have a couple of HelloFresh that I need to use up. I did freeze the meat because um, I knew with him being out of town and everything that was going on, I probably wasn't gonna be cooking too much. But in the meantime, I do need to get my life organized. Okay, let me pull, if I can, pull this one up. Normally this paper is super forgiving with the Hobonichi paper, which I'm trying desperately to stay in this planner for a year. I stayed in it most of last year, but struggle is real. Okay, I have been tracking my water intake because I have been very dehydrated. Um, I got my blood work back from my physical. It was not a pretty sight. Um, my husband got his back not good, so obviously we are not eating right and taking care of ourselves, so we are on a mission. Um, I did get braces on on the first, so that definitely has curtailed a lot of my um, bad eating habits because I can't eat the things that I normally like to eat. This one just doesn't want to fit there. Why is it? Okay, let's just... Okay, that's just, we're gonna leave that there. <laughs> we're just gonna leave that as it is. Okay, so starting on Monday, um, I'm gonna go see my mom with my sister in the morning. We are finding with her at this stage of the dementia that she has that um, if we don't get there early when she's kind of been up and having breakfast, but before lunch, then we do not have a good visit. So um, we are really trying to call ahead and if she's asleep, don't wake her up because it never ends well. And then I am gonna go back on Friday. So I'll go ahead and mark that now too. My one sister, uh, the one from Chicago that was out here um, visiting, has moved down to Tucson with her husband, which was the original plan before she came in early because my dad was in bad health. Um, so she is gone now for a little bit. And then my other sister is on spring break. She's a teacher. So on, I'm gonna put in my appointments first, but before I do that, I'm gonna go ahead and come down here and highlight my columns. I'm not working this week. I don't work until next week. Okay. I did wanna take this green go here. So in this book, I kind of thought there was a St. Patrick's Day on here, but maybe not. Maybe not. I kind of feel like this one full box though could be. Oh, okay, so I don't see one on there. 
So if I go in here into this binder, I definitely got the one. Okay, so I think this was actually, oh no, this one's right. Okay, so they do have a little, this is from the Coffee Monster Co., which is not new to anybody who's ever followed my channel. Um, this is St. Patrick's Day. So my family celebrates St. Patrick's Day. We are um, Scottish, but if you look at our genealogy, it actually comes back to Irish because they were very closely um, linked at that point in history. Actually, I believe that um, uh, when my daughter had her genealogy done, she was like, you always told me I was Scottish and I'm not, I'm Irish. I'm like, they're very closely related. Um, we did do a family Ireland trip back in 2014, probably one of my favorite trips ever. Um, so my family does celebrate St. Patrick's Day and I'll kind of tell you what our plans are for the day. Okay, this does not want to go back. We're just going to put that over here there for a second. So my sister and brother-in-law and I, unfortunately my husband has to work because um, he's been, he was out of town last week on a different job. So he has to work this week. Um, we go to a place called the Irish Wolfhound. It starts very early in the morning. Um, they take the party kind of outside there's bands all day with live music and food and of course beer and things like that. So we pretty much go out in the morning um, and stay out there as long as we can. And just kind of celebrate. So in my budget, I actually have an envelope for St. Patrick's Day that I budget for this day because it can get pricey when you're having breakfast and lunch at the restaurant. Um, so one of us will be the designated driver, probably going to be me, and then we'll just um, kind of hang out there. My other sister is going to join us. Um, this is normally a day that we would celebrate the whole day with my dad. He loved going and doing this. So we're gonna be out there celebrating for him today, or Wednesday. On Tuesday, um, we are going up north to meet with my dad's financial planner. Um, even though I felt like we just really had a handle on it, we obviously have questions. Um, I have somehow become the one who is handling all the accounts, so. I have questions. And he uses a different financial planner than what we do, so we kind of need to decide, are we going to be keeping the money there or are we going to be moving it? Not sure yet. Um, okay, so on, we need to leave. It's about two hours north, so we'll leave. Okay, on Monday, my daughter's dog is sitting here barking at me. Hey, you're fine, you're fine. You can't sell my lap right now. You can't sell my lap right now. Um, I need to... Call Ortho for detailed bill. And then I need to resubmit all my medical bills that got kicked back to me on Saturday. <laughs> that was fun. Resubmit. Yeah. 
He does not like when I'm sitting here and not paying attention to him, so he likes to sit on my lap. And you can't really do this at the same time. You're fine. You're fine. You don't have to be on my lap right now. You don't? No. <laughs> He's really cute, but kind of needy right now. You're fine. Okay. Um, so my plan for this week um, is to get all of the stuff done that I did not get done kind of over the last, you know, 10 days. Um, tonight, which is Sunday night the 13th, I am finishing up the last part of my taxes. So I need to mail them tomorrow. Let me find my labels. And I did make these super small little labels on here just so I could remember where they were in here. And I wanted to bring in some color as well. Let's see, where do I put them? Sorry, I should have pulled them all up beforehand. Okay, so on my need to meal prep tonight and go to the grocery store tomorrow. I don't have work this week. The to-do list, it's a mile long. This is my meals for the week. Okay, so videos for the week. daughter is not cleaning this month so I have been trying to get myself on a cleaning schedule you cannot sit on my lap I'm sorry errands and then Um, I still have my shop closed. I have not done anything. Um, so I've got to get myself organized this week to try to get um, that done so I can reopen the shop. Okay, on Monday, this is from White Deer Stationery. This is the sampler um, that comes as a freebie on Monday the 14th, it's my niece's birthday. And then on, okay, I'm gonna leave that there. I'm gonna go ahead and mark my videos. One moment, please, let me let him out. Okay, so I've taken him outside so I can finish up this video. So, um, I also, because I have a couple of these, I just want to mark um, the grocery one because I think these are so cute. And then, um, that'll be it. Okay, so videos for the week. Um, Friday will be my check-in on my budget. 
and Saturday will be my plan with me. I'm trying to stop doing them on Sunday because there's things come up on Sunday. I like to go to church and things like that and then my day gets away from me. So I'm gonna use these little YouTube play buttons also from White Deer Stationery. Just to mark the videos. So budget with me, plan with me. Um, I may have another one this week, but I'm not gonna commit to anything. <laughs> Cause you know what happens when you commit to it. Okay, so on Saturday night, we are going to um, go to dinner with my one daughter and um, someone she has been dating. We have not met him yet. put that on the calendar. I'm going to put church in on the calendar so I get there. I got kind of, during COVID, I got very used to just going online and, which is fine, but I really just want to start going physically back to church. I'm going to put that on my calendar. So Wednesday is the one day right now that is completely open. So I've got a couple projects I need to do on Wednesday. Um, so under... So under groceries, I'm going to put meal prep. Under to do, I need to file papers um, that are my dad's. I need to do my dad's taxes, which are a mess right now. I need to resubmit. to pay my dad's bills and then I need a list of questions for the financial planner okay under cleaning I need to redo everything I did because I am watching my daughter other daughter's golden retriever and there's hair everywhere so I need to redo everything that I just did on Friday floors laundry sheets towels dust porches I need to vacuum out my rental car because there's hair. Okay, so that is what I know I need to do right now. I've got two videos, plan with me and budget with me. So Wednesday is gonna be two things. It's gonna be let's see. try to get as much of that done so I can reopen as possible. And then the second thing it needs to be is I have a guest room that um, when my daughter moved out it just kind of became the storage room. So I have things from my mom in there and then now I have things from my dad so I need to clean guest room. I mean at this point I can't even walk in there. So um, you know I want to spend the whole day on Etsy but I need to make 
myself a little bit more productible, um, productive than that. Okay, um, for errands, I don't think I have any right now. I can't think of anything I need to buy right now. I do wanna look for new rugs for the bathroom, but not a priority. Um, so I think this right now is my week. So um, please let me, let me know down below in the comments if you have any questions. Let me know how your month is going so far and if you are enjoying this beautiful spring weather like we are in Phoenix. Um, spring training opened on Monday last week so there should be some games happening the week of the 21st so I would like to get in a game or two before I go back to work on the 25th. Um, but we'll see when those actually are. So thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, please let me know and I'll see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. There comes a time when I won't belong On these trees and these crowds and